folks welcome back to Langma School of Languages today we take you on a journey of a country renowned for its gleaming skyscrapers booming cities and the natural landscapes imagine rice terraces carved into steep hillsides market days that are a riot of colors limestone peaks jutting out from azure waters and white sand beaches and that is exactly what vietnam is one of the most popular countries in Asia visited by the backpackers across the world. The traditions of Vietnam date back thousands of years and are instilled with the respect for the land, sea and its people. The Vietnamese cuisine is appreciated across the world. It exhibits great diversity. Vietnam is also associated with the rich tradition of dance and music. Its vegetation is rich and diversified, reflecting the country's great range of climate, topography and soils with varying effects of human habitation. Vietnam has a very well-developed tradition of martial arts that is heavily influenced by Chinese martial arts. The Viet Vu Dao, the Vietnamese martial arts philosophy, guides the martial arts practice in the country. It is associated greatly with intense spirituality because of its close association with Buddhism, Taoism and Confucianism. The Vietnamese care deeply about how they are perceived by their friends, family and colleagues. Everyone is non-confrontational there because aggression causes both parties to lose face. But the vast majority of minor infringements, a stern glance is enough. Academics are quite revered in Vietnam, the job market is competitive, so young people have to be at the top of their classes if they want to succeed. There are amazing opportunities in this booming economy, but only for those who put in the work. That means long school days with tutors and extra classes at night, especially in English. The Vietnamese art is mainly influenced by Buddhism, Taoism and Confucianism. However, more recently the Sham and the French influence has also been reflected in the art presentations. Silk paintings are very popular in Vietnam and involves the liberal use of colors. Calligraphy is also a much respected art form and often during the festivals like the Lunar New Year, Vietnamese woodblock prints are also quite popular. Water puppery and several forms of theatres represent other performing art forms in Vietnam. Some of the major tourist destinations of Vietnamese is the central coast's centuries-old ancient port town Hoi An that has retained its charm despite the throngs of tourists drawn here by the heady mix of wooden-fronted merchant houses, graceful bridges and ornate temples. At night, colorful lanterns are hung from every shop front and light up the narrow streets of this atmospheric old town, casting a romantic shimmer over the Thieu Bon River. For big city fans, no visit to Vietnam is really complete without a visit to Ho Chi Minh City, the buzzing commercial hub of the country. The streets are an intense clog of motorbikes and cars, the restaurants and cafe scene is incredibly cosmopolitan and the shopping is the best in the country. For art lovers, you can find the HCMC Museum with a brilliant collection of artifacts that weaves together the story of the city and the Grand Notre Dame Cathedral built in the late 19th century. For some sandy fun in Vietnam, the Na Trang is the king. The well-maintained beach trundles for six kilometers along the shoreline with jam-packed local families on vacations. There is excellent swimming and water sports available here. Coming on to the economy of Vietnam, which is a mixed socialist-oriented market economy and the 37th largest in the world as measured by its nominal gross domestic product, it is also the 23rd largest in the world as measured by its purchasing power parity. Vietnam's economy is based on large state-owned industries such as textiles, food, furniture, plastics and paper as well as tourism and telecommunications. 
agriculture represents about 14.8% of its GDP and employs 38% of the total workforce in 2021. Main crops of Vietnam include rice, coffee, cashew, nuts, corn, pepper, sweet potatoes, tea and as well as aquaculture. Vietnam is also one of the most open economies to international trade in Asia. The Vietnamese train represented 208% of GDP in the year 2020. However, the country's workforce has a low unemployment rate of around 1.8% and it is considered a strong regional economic leader with a yearly economic growth of between 6 to 7%. The culture of Vietnam is highly multicultural. The early culture dates back to the Bronze Age and it is considered to be one of the most important progenitors for its ancient history. It was heavily influenced by the Chinese culture. Vietnam is also associated with a rich tradition of dance and music. The country has nearly 50 national music instruments. The imperial court music and the Sa Tru are important traditional forms of Vietnamese music. The lion dance, the platter dance, fan dance, imperial Latin dance are some of its traditional dance forms. The Vietnamese cuisine is appreciated across the world and it exhibits great diversity. Many types of noodles and noodle soups are popular here. Less use of oil and greater use of vegetables is preferred. Soy sauce, fish sauce, mint and basil are some of the popular ingredients. Rice of course is a staple of the region. The flavors of Vietnamese food range from a spicy to sour and sweet. The pho, a noodle soup originating in North Vietnam, is a noted Vietnamese dish and you must try if you visit it sometime. It features rice noodles with beef or chicken and scallions or bean sprouts as accompaniments. As far as the language is concerned, Vietnamese is the national and official language of Vietnam. It is currently spoken by 75 million people as their native language. It belongs to the Austroasiatic family and uses the Chu norm strict. It borrows heavily from Chinese and English. Vietnamese is increasingly being taught in schools and institutions outside of Vietnam, in countries with strongly established Vietnamese-speaking communities such as USA, France, Australia, Czech Republic, and meanwhile in countries near Vietnam such as Cambodia, Laos, and Thailand. The increased role of Vietnamese in foreign language education is commendable. Given the strong French Vietnamese population and German Vietnamese community, its strong trade and diplomatic relations are increasing. Well, Vietnamese has become a popular recruitment market for other countries. The fields attracting foreigners include the IT, construction and tourism industries specifically. You can find plenty of jobs in the field of information technology, communications, commerce and finance. In addition to its beautiful natural spots, good food, foreigners often advise each other to travel in Vietnam because this is a place very rich in culture and history. Vietnam has become a popular recruitment market for other countries. The fields and attracting foreigners include IT, construction and tourism industries. You can also find plenty of jobs in the field of information technology, communications, commerce and finance. In addition to its beautiful natural spots, great food, foreigners often advise each other to travel in Vietnam given it is a very beautiful place rich in culture and history. Well, at Langma International, we teach Vietnamese under the expert guidance of our trainers and with the aid of our exhaustive curriculums. And if you are interested in learning this language or would want to carve a career out of it, then please get in touch with us. We are renowned for organizing flexible timings with personalized sessions. Till then, stay tuned at our page for more such content and that's it for today's video. Hope you had fun. Happy exploring and bye-bye.